Hey you guys. Um, so this is different. This is really bizarre. Um, but what we're doing is a request from Corey. And uh, we're taking you into the studio. And uh, we're going to uh, do homework. So, um, I don't know. Let's have fun. Uh, you know something I want to show you guys? Um, this is pretty cool. Uh, the secret behind your drawing is going to be your sketchbooks. And uh, so each time we do this, I'll try to share something with you guys that might be something that's kind of fun. So these are the sketchbooks I use mostly. And uh, they're gorgeous. They're just absolutely beautiful. And I draw on them a lot. I probably have over 20 sketchbooks that I'm in at any given time. And uh, these are all custom made. And they're from a guy named Arthur. And Arthur's a, just a, a renaissance genius. And what he does, he's taken this stuff that's from the renaissance. It's like arches paper. This leather is just, you know, like Italian, beautiful. And they're not that expensive. And it's um, Innovative Journaling is the, the site where he's at. And he's just a purist. And uh, he's become a good friend. And... Uh, what he'll do is, you just kind of tell him what you want, and he makes it. And um, it's really cool. So uh, I'll keep showing you some of his stuff, and then other stuff that comes along the way. Like here's some marker. It's really cool. Um, but his name is Arthur, and it's Innovative Journaling. And what I like about his stuff for my students is that like if this thing fell out of an airplane, got run over by a car, and eaten by a dog, he would stand behind it and replace it. So, I mean, that's important for my kids. All right, what I'm going to do is uh, homework. And this week we're doing drapery. And what I've got in front of me is a reclining figure and then some Renaissance drapery uh, model stuff. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw the figure... But I'm going to do it as drapery because what you guys will find as we continue to work together is that if you really understand the drapery, then it does your composition, it takes care of your anatomy, um, pretty much everything. Um, so let me demo for you. I'm going to put on my headphones and take you into my studio, which is usually pretty, uh, pretty chill and pretty quiet. Um, okay, somebody wrote online, I read today, uh, Sheldon, the love and love or hate, uh, figure drawing teacher who's not serious and is like, <sighs> it was a joke. Okay, let's have some fun. I'm going to listen to Genesis.
All right. So that was fun. So I guess the uh, thing I want you guys to understand doing this kind of stuff is that I'm really not thinking anatomy. I'm just thinking drapery. But drapery has all of the rhythms and the structure and the design and the composition in it. So just grab a, a photo of a model. They're all over the internet. But make sure it's a figure drawing model, okay? And then uh, go to the Renaissance, you know, look at Leonardo da Vinci's draperies or Rubens or any of the, the masters. And then um, do the gesture, you know, of the, of the model, throw in some structures, so you know, it's going towards and back. And then just draw drapery. And I think what you guys are going to find is that later on when you're doing your anatomy, um, the anatomy gets cleaner and more designed. So this is fun because, I, I mean, i got to do my homework anyways. I, I spend, you know, 80% of my time in my studio just working and studying. So, yeah, maybe we'll do it together, okay? So it's only 34 minutes. Not too bad. And, uh, and then let's all thank Corey for being amazing. Okay, you guys, um, I'm just going to keep doing more. But it might go into some industry stuff. I might teach you character design or animation or lay I mean I'll do storyboarding I mean it's all there um, it's all the same stuff okay all right see you on the next video and for the person who wrote online that I was um, a lover hate teacher um, love me but my characters that I designed yeah they were pretty funny um, but there, there were some of them that were pretty hateful but they were supposed to be it's it was in the script so all right I'll talk to you guys later bye